That's the big one right there. Behind him. Yeah, right there. <whistles> right there. Yep. Morning, Aaron. Hey, man. How are you? Very good, thanks. How about you? Good, thanks. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Appreciate it. Good luck out there. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Darker one is a no boy though. Yeah. That blonde one though, man. So we're first morning. You know, we're out here. Uh, just see if we can glass up. We we've already seen two nice bowls. Um, but uh, Royce is telling me that there's bigger ones in here. So uh, mid morning like this, we're just seeing if we can find anything. We might have to sit on it all day, but. Uh, First morning out and we were covered up with elk. Bulls bugling everywhere. Amazing terrain. Just an absolutely gorgeous morning. We came close. Maybe next time. Oh, we saw a bunch of elk. And probably had the big one right there, but my stupid rangefinder wouldn't work. In my binoculars for some reason. Just sent Dean a nasty text. You couldn't, rat, you couldn't range them. It happened so fast. We were we were covered up in elk this morning, bugling everywhere. Tomorrow's another day though. We didn't spook him, so he's been pretty patternable right where he is. It's just a quick hunt, you know. As soon as the sun comes up, they hop that fence. But we had him beat today, which is what hurts. Killed one the first morning. What fun would it be, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Give me the breakdown here before the afternoon hunt. We're getting uh, 
getting set up. It's pretty warm, but we think these animals are going to get up and go for water here pretty soon. So I think it's going to be a good night. So ends day one. We uh, did have some elk come in the water, just no shooters. That's the bad news. Uh, good news is it's burger night at camp. So we get to head back there and find out maybe Seth got something. That's always exciting. So I'm hungry. Let's be real. I, I can't wait for burger. I, I got it. I've been thinking about this sandwich for like two hours. So I've got to, I'm just going to eat half though. Leave plenty of room for a burger. You missed my burger, Joe. I did? Yeah. It was gone quick, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Second morning in New Mexico. We got to our first spot. Heard elk bugling. Things just didn't feel quite right. So we bailed. Let's head to the next spot. Well, it's windy today. The elk aren't gonna move till about 30 minutes before daylight. So we'll go sit in the meadow and hopefully they can come out and we'll get an opportunity. 400 inches or bust. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> I'm gone. <laughs> I'm gonna stay back at camp and watch, finish watching House of Cards. <laughs> Play some cards and drink whiskey. What did you out there? snacks that I made a couple weeks ago. It's the key to a good hunt. It's the quality of your snacks. And unzipping your coat, that helps too. Day two, evening here. here yeah. you evening of day two. Windy, 20, 30 mile per hour winds, gust to 50. We got it out. Morning wasn't bad, windy, but tonight was pretty rough. Good news, 
It's Taco Tuesday back at camp, so I'm gonna go back there, get some good food, hit it again tomorrow. but no elk. Last night covered up an elk must have seen 40 or 50 mix of cows and bulls just nothing quite what we were looking for we're headed back out this morning we're hoping a nice big solid bull comes in we can thump him see the cows mm -hmm. pan left you see a dead tree I got the dead tree. Okay, First. there's one right below that. Okay, do you see the top of his antlers? Yeah. Do you see that one coming out? Yeah. The one walking away from us? Yeah. He's just a bull, not a 300 bull, it's a 340. I mean, there's still a chance to get bigger, but if we wanted him, he's on our property. I can't tell if he's a five or a six. Are you on that thing? Yeah. Okay. Is your scope cranked? Yeah. Can you tell anything about him? No, not with his head down. Oh. Okay. He's turning. Walking straight away. Looks like a fiber. Alright, so, um, we saw a lot of elk getting in here. Now we know there's elk down over this ridge, so we're just going to try to slip over the top. See if we can pick one up. Slow down a 
gonna start hunting now. Big group of cows down in here. We'll just keep working that way, see if we can find that big bull. And we um, we got the oh, bedded at 550 yards, but we're just trying to pick out what kind of bulls in there. Great effort. Yeah, we got we got in behind them, got them to stop. They were out there. We just can't get them to cooperate. Show us what they are. And so we're gonna make a new plan. Can we get an Uber from that? We need an Uber right now. <laughs> we need a helicopter Uber and a turkey sandwich. Again. Where is he? Left his ass sticking out from behind. Oh, gotta get out in the meadow. Watched it back this That's far. I'm like, I gotta watch it again. Wild this way. Riley, what are you doing? <laughs> we started running. We started just running. bull across the fence right in here let's cruise up just over this rise okay. we should have a little vision okay um, we'll see if we can't get back on him and it'll be quick if it happens okay, okay right? I'll let's be go ready. check it out yeah, I'm dialed. let's just catch our breath go right over this little ridge okay. look down at the bottom okay. yeah just get right on it Squeeze. 
on him. So we feel like we got a pretty good hit on this bull, but we can't see where he went down. You guys stay right here. Okay. Watch this, uh, watch this hillside. Okay. I'm gonna come back around, check for a little blood, and then we'll go from there, okay? okay. Sounds good. All right, let's go. Compass West Outfitters, my guide Jeff, Riley behind the camera. We're here for meat. We got it done. Yes. Love it. Absolutely love it. <laughs> Five by five, oh. last day bull, brother. Ooh. Last day bull. Oh. Oh. Wait, I've been wanting to do this. <laughs> Get that morning sun. <laughs> same, there you go. same color as the there bull. There you go. <sighs> Check him out. Yes. Yes. Oh, man. Oh, I love it. Yes. You're going to be some good meat, buddy. Yes. Look at them fronts, man. I know, oh. he's a beauty. He's nice. This is exactly what I was hoping for. Oh, yes. Day five. You hunted hard, you were patient. We did everything right, and it uh, came together in the end. Last morning. Yes. Let's get your delicious meat off, boy. Looks I like think well, I think we'll kind of maybe we'll spin them this way. Sure. And then get them right here in the sun. Take a few photos, and then go to work. Let's do it. All finished quartering, everything's in game bags. Gonna do a little bit more trimming on this, get a little bit more of this meat off of here. We certainly don't want anything to go to waste. And we're gonna get out of here. Hell yeah. <laughs> nice, man. Good job, buddy. Good job. Good. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. Is that the one you were after? Is that the six by five? No, five by five. Nice bull, Scott. Thanks, Scott. Same to you. Thank you. Success, fellas. Yeah, got him. <laughs> nice. Feels good, doesn't yeah. it? Redemption. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We're at Compass West Outfitters Cooler. 
They've got to walk in. We're going to get this bull out of here. We've got him quartered in the back of the truck. It's going to go, go in the cooler. It's going to start chilling. We've got him on our racks, all quartered. Central part of this process is getting him in a walk-in cooler and getting him chilled down. After it chills down, we're going to let him age for a few days. We've got all this awesome meat processing equipment here behind us. We'll get him worked up, but uh, for now, he's going in the cooler.